Hello and welcome back to episode 15. It's gonna continue with the main, the main story. So. A papal bull, the lead seal marking the authenticity of a document. This must have been attached to something of great import, like a writ of excommunication. So we need the other one. That one. I can't use this gun. How the hell did I survive that? I'm like super tanky. You know what? I think we're gonna go back and save. But oh, we can't. Well.
Get the hell out of here. I said to use. Really? Those choppers should be in range soon. They're here! Oh, there's one down. We did it. Really? Lara, are you there? Trinity is swarming the tower. We're trapped in the catacombs beneath. Damn! Just hold on! I'm on my way! Elias and I will attempt to reach the far hills, where the old bear lives. Trinity is still clustered below in the old Soviet base. We will wait until the dead of night to go. It is a great risk, but we know a battle is coming. We'll have need of the medicinal herbs that grow in those hills, if we are to survive the coming struggle. Alright, so can we get to save here maybe? Yes, we can. Nothing in here.
Reload speed, like that is big. This has the worst reload speed ever. Tier 7. It is our first winter since the Mongol invasion. No more than one in three of us will survive. We once had marble palaces, heated by geothermal vents. We had the wealth and luxury of an empire. Today, we struggle to find enough hides to keep our children warm, to gather enough roots and berries to feed ourselves. If we are to survive another winter, we will have to adapt. If we do not, then we will feed the soil, and the animals will take back the valley. It is up to us now. Only us. Seriously.
Come on. Are you fucking serious? That was nuts. What? Did not fucking down. Come on! Oh, I hate these fuckers. Wow. That was crazy. Jacob. They're gone. I fear this battle is far from over. Will you tell me more about this place? You've earned that much. Come with me. In ancient times, our prophet brought the divine source to this valley. My ancestors built a test to protect it from the outside world. To what end? What is the divine source, Jacob? An artifact from a time long forgotten. We believe it holds a fragment of God's soul. Legend tells us those who beheld the source were granted immortality. But others have always been drawn here, seeking its power. Trinity. Yes. They seek to spread their darkness across the world. With the source, their soldiers would be unstoppable. Then help me find it before they do. This is not your burden. Of course it is. My father died for this. You can't fill the emptiness inside you, Lara. You can only set it free. I'm gonna find it. With or without you. There are a lot of shoppers. Wait, Sophia, let me go. I have to do what I can. You spilled blood for us. I want to help. You know where the Atlas is? 
the cathedral in the archives below. But we won't follow you there. Why? What will I find? There are others. The deathless ones. They will kill any who trespass. My father believes they will stop Trinity. I can't take that chance. I know. Here. Take this. It will help you reach the cathedral. Now give me a side point, please. Back to the forest. back oh we can't look I wasted everything in that fight look at the ammo situation Oh no. Like, don't force me to make some difficult platforming with a new mechanic before I get the uh, get save point. <coughs> Like they're gonna force me to do platforming stuff and I'm gonna die. I have to redo the fight and everything. Grab the ledge. Try grab the legs while jumping to reach for ledges. Like come on. The bones of the earth itself offer up their wealth. And we have learned to survive and subsist. Oil bubbles up from below. It can be gathered in the deep places, caves, dens, and our ancestors' tombs. And it will burn with little effort. In times of war, we coat our arrows to make them burn. Deeper still, you can find metal in shining veins that can be mined for their ore. We use that metal to forge simple tools. But someday, we will need that metal to repair the Soviet weapons. Living in harmony with the land rarely means living in harmony with our fellow man. And there's more of this. Like, this is just fucking cruel that it make you do this after a fight like that. Reflex can hook onto rock walls. Laura. 
If you're headed to the cathedral, Trinity will be everywhere. I know, but I have no choice. My goodness. Break action, shotgun piece. So much violence and death. Jacob's people have been through so much, yet they continue to fight. They are bound by an oath taken by their ancestors. A duty handed down from the past. But I see a people who simply want to live in peace. I believe it's time for them to let go of the past. If I can find the Atlas, it might lead to the Divine Source. I could take it away from here. They wouldn't have to suffer anymore. They could share the burden of the truth with the world. But if all this leads to nothing. I don't know what I'll do. Custom trigger. Modified ejector. There we have it. Alright, so what now? Sneak or fight to the occupied village. Oh, so this is how you get to this area. You'll never find a finer meat than boar. As black as the soil and twice as rich. But hunting the damned things is an unpleasant task, to say the least. Now that the sun is up, we will hunt as a pack, working together to take down a boar. We will strike from the hunting blinds around the valley, for we can spot the boar in the dense undergrowth without being seen. And you do not want to be seen. At least it's not raining. None of you. Not even I want to deal with that cursed Razorback. Get down. God, I can't make any more. Have 
piece of part. So only one part left. I can no longer deny the pull that Alia has on me. She came to me, alone, as I walk the passes high above the valley. I know now that the draw was mutual. I explained to her why I could not, should not, why my position amongst our people should preclude such folly, why I could never make her happy. But it didn't matter what I said. As my mouth spoke, my arms reached out to enfold her, and we embraced. It has been so long, and I am still human. Oh. We got everything here. Just the ones they think might know something about the Atlas. Constantine's gonna ask them a few questions. They've got the rest back up near the cathedral. Hmm. Someone's gonna have some fun. That must be them. Oh, this one is gonna open they draw back here, I think. Job. Oh well. How long you been on the payroll? A few months. This is my first wet work assignment. It's been too long since I was in the field. I got rusty. You? Been with Constantine for just about a year now. Had an old war buddy that vouched for me. Before that, I was working for one of the families in Kiev, and uh, I had to get out of town. Is there always this much opportunity? No, this uh, this is a special case. Saber. Usually, it's a much smaller scale and more discreet. That's a shame. You can't scale them, I think. Used to this. Yeah, I don't know. Something's weird about. It. Incoming! We're under attack. <laughs> We've been clear. What was that? Let's move. I'm on it. Keep her down. Show your back. Grenade out. Now we got a flank. Roger that. <laughs> Taking fire. Messer.
This one was strong. This one is gonna go to something. There. Oh, I see. So we could have sneaked up here. I've attached everything I've learned so far. Anna and Constantine, they're in charge out here, but someone else is pulling the strings above them. Someone with a lot of cash and the means to move it around. I've narrowed down the source, but I'm having a hard time believing someone in the Vatican is running a private army. But all roads lead to Rome. Trust me, this sounds crazy even to me, but people have to know this. If I'm gonna die for this, I want to be on the right side for once. And Constantine? I know you're probably reading this too. You might make me disappear, but you won't win out here. And if I never get the chance to say it to your face, you're out of your fucking mind. Alright, so this is probably going to take us over here to all of these items. Wow. Are you fucking kidding me? This is gonna set us back a million years. Oh fuck this. This is so far back. Are you kidding me? This is crazy.
I can no Is this a save point? What is this? A friend? Can you save here? What is this? Alive. Good. We got most of the wounded to safety, but the invaders returned. They've taken the upper village. Yeah. There are more of us down in the valley, organizing for our resistance. We'll take any extra hands we can get. If you're going back to the village, be careful. Hello. The Soviets abandoned this place in a hurry, and they left salvage all over the valley. Put it to good use. So, like, we can take another route to get out of here. What? Kind of seems like it. I mean, I, I don't mind fighting it and killing them, but uh, it would be nice to get to a save point first. Come on. I wonder if we can read uh, the monolith now. <sighs> oh, so this is like the very beginning. Still can't do it. Byzantine script, but I can't quite make it out. But you know what? There's like a ton of stuff that we could do now with them, um, with the explosive arrows, like different areas that we can get access to. So we could do, like, we could go back to the very beginning and uh, and open up some stuff. Fifteen coins. You been here? Yeah, we have. So let's go and save for someone. Yeah. 
It was like interesting that we could uh, take different routes here. It was usually you can't. up okay I think we only need like one or two more documents and after that we will have the required uh, skill in, uh, in Greek We have a true test now, young ones. The valley is balance. When one thing slides, it affects all others. The fire two harvests ago led to an unusual bloom of berries. That led to more deer. And now, we've got too many damned wolves. They're not good eating, but to keep the valley in harmony, we're tracking wolves tonight. They come out after dark and roam the whole valley, but we're going to track them to their dens in caves and other underground places. Stay close together. When you hunt wolves, the wolves are just as likely to hunt you. Did I kill this, this cat here? I don't remember. didn't. I was gonna stay in there, right? Yeah. Out again. That is 
really, really annoying. Okay, so let's go back to the very beginning. I remember a place where you needed explosives. Where was it? Villainous. Base camp. Maybe here, somewhere? Here. Is this a, a tomb? Where's a cave? Any critters? Oh, oh yeah, of course.
They're all set. This is nothing. Really? Well, that's disappointing. I do have another one here as well. It could be easiest to get here and then fast travel. Is at like the very, the very bottom. Break action shotgun piece. Like these two are the only ones that I remember like right away, but it, there are others as well, I think. Okay. 
cut this. Come on. Wow. That was some unexpected action. Oh, look at this. More load modification. Pump grip. Burner shroud. Tube magazine. I remember one more of these in uh, the very beginning area with um, with a bear. Mongolian passage, like in this area, I believe. Yeah, this one. You need explosives to open that. Right, or this thing? Okay. Ring for a Mongolian archer. 
allowing them to shoot quickly while still mounted on horseback. This must have belonged to a warrior of some stature. Look, there's more in there. But so maybe that is the one I was thinking about. Here. Yeah. And I use this weapon because I have more bullets of this. If you wonder. <laughs> Seriously? Well, whatever. I would learn her. A Mongolian tug. A banner of sorts to be affixed to a spear. This one looks like it's seen some violence. Right, so... We are completely done in this area. 100%. Which is the first area that we have completed. That's pretty cool. Resourceful, competent, enemies killed or knocked out from crowd handheld objects yield more XP. This is probably something that I should have taken earlier. That's it for this episode. If you like this, please leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you want. And thank you for watching. Bye bye.